Hey everyone, and welcome to the second episode of my playthrough. I hope you enjoy it. Go hunt some jellyfish. So, do I have to go here? Okay, so that's jellyfish. Yes, I'll fish. In the meantime, I'm gonna fish. I love that cat. It's so adorable. Look at his eyes. Is she? Is she? Is she? Is she? Another old shoe. That's. Another old shoe. I just want fish, not old shoes. Shut your eyes on the mm. ones with bright jelly. They should be visible enough. That said, pop as many as you can. You'll get glims anyway. I will wait. I'm tired, it's just too mm. hard for me to stay out here. Okay, go ahead. I believe in you. Wait, what am I supposed to do? supposed to be doing. Ah! Wait, why am I so bad at this? Rocked out there, tumbling and diving like a shooting star, and without the slightest fear nor hesitation at that. I definitely haven't lost your touch, so mm -hmm. And you even gathered enough bright jelly to build a proper kitchen. Go for it. I'll be patiently mm -hmm. waiting. Slowly digesting myself. <laughs> she's, she's like so fed up with her. Alright, build. And she wants a kitchen. Should I do the kitchen? Here? On top of that house? Oh dear, we're 
kitchen should probably be on the bottom for now. Sorry about that. Okay, so I have the food now. Ooh. Lovely kitchen. Put any one ingredient in the oven and wait for it to be cooked. You could even try these loom corn. That would have um have been hanging around my pockets. Can't wait to see you in your cooking glory again. You got this. Aw, thank you. She's so sweet. Okay, so that. Okay, so that. Why? Oh, this need you meet. Yay! That's so cool. I made you popcorn, Stella. I can eat anything. Just give me some food. Popcorn! Well, I won't die just yet. Oh my gosh. Thanks, Stella. It's better than I thought it could be. But then again, why does she have cake in her hands when I gave her popcorn? Mm -hmm. It's been a wonder in the kitchen. Don't forget, spirits don't run on sunshine and water. It's too dark to navigate. It would be impossible to. Okay. We need a good meal once in a while. It will be up to you to understand mm -hmm. who's fond of what. As for me, I'm sure you remember I've always loved comfort food. That I would die for a cup of coffee. But I'm not that picky. I can eat anything. Mm -hmm. Just never the same thing twice. Oh, and before I forget, there's something I was supposed to give mm -hmm. you. Not sure exactly how it works, but a no ball is a symbol of passage. A fee each spirit has to pay to you. Something tells me you knew mm -hmm. that already. Okay, let's keep on improving this craft. As you must have seen in your blueprint table, there is both a field and a garden blueprint. Mm -hmm. Which means you can grow many different things. And turn this ship into an adorable farm of sorts. You should add a field first, in my Aww. opinion. It's going to be easier to find resources for it around here, and you can grow linen in it. 
which in turn will be used to craft more things. In addition to building a field, we should go buy seeds to use it in. But that will come later. I need you to visit an island close by. It's called Most Mostine Co Cove. I'm having so much issues talking, I'm so sorry. And there's something on it we need. I'll tell you when we get there. Yeah, well, right now we can't really- What? Ah, yes. I got to tell you about this. As you can see, this boat stops at night. I believe it's a side effect of your Everlight being well liked. Or some other technicality. I love how when she's like sassy, <laughs> Stella's like has had enough of it. <laughs> or mm -hmm. That being said, it will allow people to sleep undisturbed. You in the meantime can do anything you want. Tackle unfinished business or just chill on the deck under the stars. I'd suggest you go to sleep too in that cozy little room atop your mm -hmm. cabin. You'll wake up refreshed and ready to go. And this ship will start up again in the morning. Oh, and speaking of that, you know me. Waking up on time has never been my forte. Mm -hmm. You can ring that big bell over there to wake people up. Remember, only do it at the right time. Mm -hmm. Early morning should do the trick. Speaking of asleep, time for me to take a nap. See you tomorrow, mm -hmm. Stella. Okay, I can already see in the cat in the thing at the top, right, that there's a bell. So, have a good night. So let's see. She said to make a field, right? Do I have everything that I need to make a field? No. Of course I don't have everything to make a field. Alright. Let's go sleep. Yes. Oh, that's so freaking adorable. Time to ring the bell! Ring a ding ding! Aww! <laughs> God, that cat is so cute! Uh, LB. Alright. Let's see. We are going to. This place, right? It's this. Do I need to follow everything like absolute? I don't know what I'll follow. Good morning, Stella. Mm -hmm. oh, I, I forget I have to read, but his interest is all things mm -hmm. useful, such as a boat of grids he sells for. This will be able to cross the the classic mm -hmm. challenges again. A bit cliche if you ask me. Um, mood. Can I hug her? Hmm? Oh, mm. I really like that. Oh. There it is. That's really awesome. Can I go in there? see what it looks like. It's cool. I love how it's like a picture of me in the back. Mm -hmm. Yes. You know I'm delighted that you're here with me, but I'm not surprised one bit. Oh. It adds up. You're here taking care of me for my, in my final hours. I've always cared so damn much about others. Oops, sorry. Mm -hmm. Always protected. Oh, what was that? Those you found vulnerable. Even in den pit pedantic snobs like me. Remember that day my father yelled oh. at the cat? Just got out of elementary school. We were wearing those blue sneakers with the glittering tents. And we were yelling back at my father mm -hmm. like you were on a mission. His father turned red and smashed a purple Delano vase. It was bad. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we should hop on the island. Yay, we're here. Awesome. Maybe we'll find something interesting. Oh yeah, I have to take the boat, right? I love this.
Okay. What a majestic tree. Well, you can cut it down. Yes, it's fine. I mm. promise. It's a way to get wood you need, actually. But don't worry, they'll regrow over time. Another interesting fact about the Everlight. Alright, how do we do this? Oh. Oh my god! Oh, it's gonna fall on you, darling. Well done! Congratulations! You have become death. The destroyer of worlds. <laughs> Joke aside, that's how you do it. You go on ahead, cutting down more trees. And we can go back to the boat and build the field with all those paper logs. I'll be next to the raft. Ooh. Berries? Raspberries? Oh, this is so cool. So I can find things. As I okay. Oh, this is so cute. Alright, so I have to go all the way to the wood. Oh, sorry, kitty. Oh. Okay, wait. Okay. Yeah. Oh, wow. Okay. Can I swim? No. Okay. <laughs> Cats in this cat is like my favorite thing. <laughs> it really doesn't like water. Okay, I think I got everything I needed here. Let's right. Oh wait, can I still get stuff from here? No? Okay. Trees, I'm done. Is she happy? I gotta hug her. Hello. Okay. What's wrong with you then? Oh, you're hungry? Okay. Well, let's go back. Wait. Am I leaving her there? Okay, no. I gotta make her food. That's all I have right now. Oh my god, did I just meow? I'm sorry. Alright, let's go give her some popcorn. Okay. Okay, so what do you- okay, so they're picky. I mean, girl? to give you like a field oh my god that is like takes a lot of room Ooh. yeah a field Ooh. there's a little je ne sais quoi to it simple mm. but elegant now all you have to do is plant field se seeds in there. Seeds can grow only in their respective places. Garden seeds won't grow in a field, so don't mm -hmm. bother trying. Okay. But you know me. Kill a plastic cactus. Don't take my word on this. Anyway, there's only one place where we could possibly find Oh, excuse me. Theodore spe specializes in mm -hmm. seeds. He has set up shop in Hummingbird, the busiest town of the area. Theodore and his brothers are the founders of Raccoon Inc., a shady retail franchise with very loose moral values. Yes, this world has a serious problem of dubious business practices. Reach. Since I don't want you to get swindled, I'll come with you and do most of the talking. I've run into this cheeky little raccoon once and his dishonesty was blatant. Let's head to Hummingbird Den. <laughs> I don't like that that, um, I'm gonna place things, like, in proper order as, uh, 
As we go on, it's just for like right now. It's that's pretty much all I can do. I don't know the game, so um, just gonna. What's this? All right, let's go there. Like it says she's hungry, but I mean, what do you want to eat, girl? I have fish. Do you want fish? Let's see. Okay. Hook. Okay. What's that gonna cook? I'm pretty sure she's gonna hate it. Whatever I cook in her. Oh wow, this is very long. I'm guessing I don't have to stand here the whole time, but I mean, kind of nervous. <laughs> the kitty is so cute. Kitty, oh. I can't get enough of it. Okay, let's see what that gives us. Grilled fish? Is that considered, um... So she's happy again. So she dislikes fruit. So I guess I have to talk to them to like um, figure out stuff. So it's just socializing. I guess that's what she meant. Because I gave her food and she said fruit and she said, you know, I don't like fruit. So I guess. Oh, I have to wait for her though. Don't I? Come on, girl. Let's go. Oh no, okay. Oh. We're here! Let's buy some seeds. Theodore has set up shop on this island. Let's pay him a visit. Let's go, girl. Mm -hmm. Hey everyone, so that was my second playthrough of Spirit Fair. I'm loving it. I'll have more episodes in the next couple of weeks, so make sure to like and subscribe. And I'll see you later. Thank you.